Hi friends, in this video we are going to see in detail how to create lip sync animation using PowerPoint. The idea here is to create different lip pose and show as image sequence. I am going to show you in detail how to create each of these lip pose and also how to animate the lip movement using the lip poses. This reference image I got from internet. I am going to use circle shape to draw the lips here. So first I am going to fill the shape with the no fill. So which will be useful for me you know to create the borders properly. So I am going to place this on top of the reference image. I use the edit point option. You can see the right click edit point. So which will help us to um, transform uh, the circle to any other shape. So basically I'm what I'm going to do is I'm going to just you know uh, follow or uh, the border of the reference lip here. So to create the outer uh, shape. So I have you know uh, different I can create different points insert different points and edit points and also you know I can adjust using the the, the vertical uh, lines you can see there are two do uh, white dots right so you can you can adjust the curves using those okay now it looks better oh, no. Okay, so now the outer shape is fine. Next I am going to create the tongue and the teeth. For teeth I am going to use the uh, same circle shape. But now like I am more concerned about only the inner uh, region. So I am going to use the merge option to get that uh, shape. So here I am taking the copy of the lip border. So now like select both the shape go to merge fragment so it will basically they fragment the intersection regions and see here like we can uh, see the shape of the teeth okay. similarly i'm going to uh, use the same technique for the tongue as well so i'm, tr um, I'm trying to you know align the inner shape to match with the tongue here i'm going to edit option to you know uh, to get that in the arc okay so now uh, again uh, I'm going to use the same merge option uh, take the copy of this uh, just try to fit both shapes or select both the shape go to merge use the fragment Okay, now we uh, got the tongue shape. Now we have the three shapes ready. Let's combine three. So we have teeth and we have um, the tongue. Okay. So next step is to uh, you know give the proper color. So I'm going to uh, give the shape fill. So this eyedropper, yeah. I have given the white color and just remove the border the outline no outline next I am going to give the color for the mouth uh, teeth is gone yeah just go to send back yeah now we have teeth here and now apply the same shape fill for uh, tongue as well using eyedropper and remove the outline yep now yeah, i can even remove the outline of the lip or um, if you want a shade i can you know uh, select uh, i can just reduce the width of the outline so so that we'll have a little shade uh, over the boundary or you can uh, if you have a, a contrast background you can even uh, remove the uh, outline now just group the three uh, shapes now you will get uh, the exact lip shape 
similarly i'm going to create the other lip shades
have four different lip shapes ready i am going to uh, create the fifth one by just uh, you know resizing the uh, fourth lip shape uh, and you know, make it just a circle and now we have uh, five different lip shapes uh, i'm going to create an animation so for creating uh, the animation i need uh, nine different shapes so uh, you can uh, refer my previous videos like mainly the walking man animation like there we need nine different poses to create uh, the animation so what i'm going to do is i'm going to you know copy the four uh, 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 shapes again to have like five plus four nine different shapes I am I'm placing it in proper way so that you know uh, if you do the animation the animation looks proper okay so uh, as as uh, if you if you are if you have seen my previous video you would have aware of the flash one anima once animation else like you can again refer my previous videos it's a flash one animation i'm just going to you know cop apply the flash one animation to all the nine different shapes so <coughs> yeah so so we have um, uh, the flash on animation applied to all the shapes now what i have to set the timing like uh, uh, no for each um, so start with zero of uh, and for each shapes i'll apply the delay of 0.1 millisecond the idea here is uh, uh, to uh, you know um, to show the image uh, at a rate of 10 frames or 9 frames per second so that we'll have an uh, an effect of the video sequence so that's the whole idea behind it now i'm going to make it a saline center and middle let's see how it looks like it's it's okay but it is um, a bit faster to reduce the speed i can increase the delay from uh, i can double the delay basically uh, you know change from 0.1 to 0.2 and 0.2 to 0.4 so if you increase the delay uh, the um, uh, the frames will be played at a low frame rate uh, so basically it will reduce from 10 fps to 5 fps and you can see uh, the animation at this lower interval or slower face yeah so you can uh, you know uh, play around with the timing and uh, do uh, as per your requirement now let's see how it looks like if it plays uh, you know this lips in the um, the face of the kid okay uh, so this is the mm, character which i have created again like you can see in my previous video how to you know create different characters uh, yeah uh, so now here basically i have the face here without the lips uh, yeah maybe i need to scale up or scale scale up the face or scale down the lips to fit and the face okay <coughs> yeah we can use the resize option uh, so i have selected all the lips and uh, make sure like you click the lock aspect ratio so that you won't face any issue in uh, related to aspect ratio and you can you know change the percent if you change if you lock the aspect ratio and if you change one of the either height or width the other will automatically change based on the aspect previous aspect ratio yeah, now it looks a bit big again i had i can still you know change yeah, i can i can change i can play or basically we can play around the size and other things and uh, you know make make sure like here the thing is like the the shape is very dominant the oval shape which is creating a bit uh, 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 uncomfortable animation so maybe i'm i'm going to you know i i basically just yeah 
just resize that oval shape lip so that it will fit within the mouth. After toning, the face like uh, looks like this. Uh, I'm just going to place a, a, a rectangle bust just to hide the body. Uh, let's see how it looks like. Yeah, no, it looks better. Please like and subscribe our channel. Thank you.